Hello, hello, Aries, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today, we are going to be pulling Friday mini messages. Please, universal energies, spirit guides, ancestors, please bring forward two more messages for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please, universal energies. Okay. All right, you have here Aries. You start off with squirrel spirit. Believe in yourself. Believe in who you are. You have here starfish spirit. Open to infinite possibility. The world is limitless is what I just heard, okay? Um, so crab, I don't even think I'm saying that right. Beetle spirit. Magic works through you. Some of you have good vibration. You know, some of you have good vibration. <clears throat> Please universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors. Please bring forward three messages for Aries, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Please universal energy, spirit guides, ancestors. Please bring forward three messages for Aries, Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Please, universal energies. I need one more. There's two people here. Um, and there's a, somebody walking away. All right, listen. The emperor is somebody who's very controlling, somebody who is very their way, the highway. They're not very by the book. They're somebody that are very strict. They're very powerful as well. I always see the emperor as very controlling, trying to control everybody else's life. Um, I also have here in the past, Hierophant. So with the Hierophant, this is um, someone who is a teacher. This is someone who you know, um, comes through as having also a spiritual awakening. This could also be for some of you married in the past. Okay. So there's a couple of issues here or a couple of scenarios that could be, um, but we're going to see when we clarify, we also have here eight of cups. Some of you are abandoning ship from a place. This could you, this is movement going forward. Um, getting out of a situation, abandoning, um, no more, no more emotionally, involved in a situation okay um let me see why is the emperor here for aries please universal energies aries why is it here the emperor the emperor why is it here please universal energies spirit guides ancestors okay king of swords a decisive decision, a manipulator is what I'm hearing, okay? Because when I see the the emperor and the king of swords, that's a lot of fucking power, okay? This is a person that probably works a lot. This could be you, okay? Maybe you're controlling. Maybe you are very by the book. Maybe you recently had a spiritual awakening. Maybe you are working on your money, Okay, there's money coming in for you here over the things that you have decided for your own life, for your own benefit. Why is um, the Hierophant here? Okay, I just thought I saw something turned over. Is it this? Yes. Seven of Cups. When you had the spiritual awakening, you realized that there was decisions that you could make, that there was choices that you had. There was open things for you, open roads with the seven of cups. Why is the eight of cups here? Please, universal energies, eight of cups. Why is it here? Eight of cups. Eight of cups. Why is the eight of cups here? These universal energies, eight of cups. Queen of wands, six. Of, listen, this is a third party energy. Okay, for some of you, I'm telling you right now, this is going, if some of you are walking into a third party energy, 
Um, I feel that if you are in a situation where you woke up to some choices, some of you are walking away. The problem is that you have here a mistress, somebody who's non-committal, somebody who is just, you know, you're walking away and you're walking into this. Six of Pentacles, breadcrumbing a person. And listen, there's heartbreak here. Okay, there is heartbreak here. Um, so with the three of swords, this is a heartbreak. This is something that is a betrayal as well. So for some of you, listen, be very careful of walking from a place where you had everything under control to walking into a place that's going to make your life a living hell. Okay, Aries, thank you so much for being here and enjoy your weekend.